Welcome to this Advanced Steel 2020 tutorial. Today, I will show you how to export plan view drawing for factory steel structure. First and foremost turn on Advanced Steel Tool Palette and Drawing Style Palette. Reset the user coordinate system to the orthogonal world coordinate system. To create drawing, choose Drawing Style Palette, then click on 3.2 Plan. In Create Detail dialog box, select Create with default settings. To open drawing, choose Document Manager, then select Drawing 001, finally hit on Open Drawing. You can see plan view of factory steel structure, with grid and dimension. Double-click on percent note, the label and symbols dialog box appeal. You can change the note to plan view. Now you can see only partial reinforced slope footing has been shown on the drawing. To show fully concrete footing, select the inner green box, right click and then choose advanced properties. In Advanced Steel View dialog box, at Rear Field, input 1500 to increase the view volume and then hit OK to update drawing. Now you see all footing has been come out. If the dimension is not like what you want, just delete it, and add a new one. To start the DIM tool, click on Parametric Dimension then select a plan view, first point and second point.
You can change the balloon frame style if you want, in this tutorial I set it as circle frame. You can drag and drop the grip point, in order to move the grid line to the left or right, up or down. You can adjust grid extension, make it shorter or longer. You can insert label for column, to do this just click on insert label on tab label and dimensions and then select web of column. We can do with the same procedure for the rest of the columns.
you can adjust the balloon grid style. By choosing management tools and then select default, and then select use filter. Type ball. In use filter field. Now you can change the balloon type for grid axis label, you can choose rectangle, rounded, circle. Adjust the grid balloon circle frame radius, increase radius to 10. Close the management tools, and then select update default to reload the latest data from advanced steel database. Now update the drawing to show the change we have just made. Thanks for watching this video. Check out my Chanel for more amazing and free video. Leave me the comments below, if you have any ideas to improve my futures guides.